huge shout out to Aussie Lure Buddies. They gave us a few free of these things. They're like rod holders. They keep them together. They also gave us a few free stickers. Good stickers too. And their names. Paul and Wendy. Huge shout out to Paul and Wendy. Thanks guys. Alright, so unfortunately the Palmerstone Passage was a bit windy, so we had to come to Karamundi Lake. Hopefully we're just doing some drift next to the bridge. Hopefully we get some. So it just started pouring down, but we got the bimini and the umbrella up. It would be worse if we didn't have a bimini though. So. First catch of the day. Ooh, I did it beforehand. get the sticker guys and we'll enter those into the comp. So I got these three little trevally. We're just gonna let them go. It's one. The two. And the biggest one, number three. Let him go. Got those guys in the cast net. <laughs> the fishing comp. Also, Aussie Little Buddies found good to hold your phone in and they're waterproof. So it keeps your phone nice and dry. Go give Aussie Little Buddies a look. This thing's pretty handy. Third cast. Got a little flounder. We got something here every cast. Don't come here, guys. It's a terrible place to go fishing. Yeah, don't come here. You don't get nothing. But it doesn't bite me. Palm sized flounder. Or a sole. I think sole's around it. I'll let him go. He goes. Oh, you got heaps of herring. Perfect. That was my second cast, third cast. Got a whole heap of herring. And a, another Trevally. Another Trevally. Even bigger. Yeah, enter him into the comp too. Oh, and a Moses. That was my best cast. Yeah. Did I get the Trevally and the other one too? Um, no, I got the Trevally. Okay. Chuck the herring okay. in the bait bucket. Put that in there. Get this Moses out quickly. Having better luck. Um, casting and then we are fishing. Do you know it's fishy here? Mm. Because I've got good fishing. Could, but there wouldn't be any point bringing the boat. 
Let's be shooting now. Right, little Moses, let him go. It's a herring. Charlie's in there. And it starts raining. Yeah, no, get under. Get under, quick. Deal with them after. She's pouring. Oh, I'll get my phone and wallet. Put my phone in there. Pouring, the boat's gonna be full of water. Can I move my bag? Yeah. Oi. Oh yeah. My bag's drenched. Right. Oh, I think it's gonna get me. Separate little trevally, let him go. Alright, so we got the first fish on. Quick, it's taking it over. It's a brim. Decent, half decent brim. If you guys notice in my videos, so in every video, I always get like stabbed or spiked by the fish. Oh, got me good. Oh, oh. Website DNA, Deep Blue DNA Fishing Comp. I cannot remember. Um, no, nah, because when I clicked into it, and I tried to search it, but it can't look for other ones. So take some photos of this, guys. Alright. Got the photos. Let him go. Decent brain. Off he goes. Oh, I'm on again, guys. Feels little, but it's coming towards us. So I don't really know. Oh, it's an old apple. Oh, no. Have a decent brain. Barely hooked. Chuck him in there and I'll see you in a second. So I'll just measure this brim up quickly. Alright. We'll measure it up. Time to let him go. Oh, my second brim for the day. Off he goes. Aiden's first fish for the day. Yeah, Aiden's first brim. Yeah. Right. Measure him up, take a photo with him and let him go. Aiden's first fish, just gonna let him go. 
Is that third or fourth room that they? Third or fourth. Uh, third, I think. No. Third room. So Aiden. Well, found the looking flattered just there. This little stinger cow tail. Good luck getting the hook out, Aiden. We'll get the hook out and let him go. I'll right, just let this little stingray go now. Okay. I just got picked up from the boat ramp. And we're gonna head home now. So thank you for watching part two of the Moolabar River fishing comp. See you in part three. Whew.